Welcome to CAD Concepts. Today we will design complete section detail in just one time using YQRS plugin. Previous chapter we have created four side elevation and today we will design from the same floor plan complete inner section detail. We will use YQRS plugin to fast test section detail. You did not join membership. Many and many join already membership. You are great welcome to join. You will get amazing insights over there. Free use blocks, risk routine, advanced AI tutorial tips and tricks and lot. And also this is the best possible way to support those who influence your knowledge and learning. So without wasting time, let's begin. This floor plan we have including parapet projections okay our unit is feet and inches okay just draw your section line sy3 command choose first point and second point okay your direction this is our section line we will create as per this section line our detailed section okay so these text furniture layout let this isolate okay erf using erf short key you can isolate let this one also this door we have removed to create clean inner boundary okay so we have clean inner area for getting our complete inner boundary type lm command for your indoor section pick up in room single elevation let this vary and vary carefully okay floor covering thickness zero Store height 120. This is our inches unit, which is equal to 10 feet. Okay. Board thickness will keep 10 inch. Okay. Beam height. Beam height let this 18 inches. Ceiling height 102. 18 plus 100, 102 equal to 120. Right. Let this board thickness thickness 10 inch. This is our exactly slab thickness. Skirting height 0 or wall thickness, okay. Outer wall thickness 9 inch. Window height or window height as per elevation also 45, right. And same window offset from ground level 35 inches, okay. So 35 plus 45 equal to door height which is 80 inches. This is okay. Come to here. Layer color for your solid hash. Layer color I keep 9 here for gray color. Okay. Hash name solid. You must have to place correct name. Okay. For your hash. Hash scale 0. So these parameters you must have to understand as per architectural detail. Okay. Okay. What you do? Click inside. We have chosen pick up in room. Right. When you click inside, it will ask you which direction you want. This direction or this or this or this direction. We will take this one right. Click one time. This is okay. And click here. You will get above plan and detailed inner section detail including whatever you are reflecting through section line. Okay, this is our wall. Outer wall and two windows we are getting here. WDE command which is our door window elevation okay this is our window elevation now let this line remove this dimensions also remove okay we will match this wall line from here and from here this is our concrete area and here also dimensions removed from this side and this side also let this solid hash this is exactly our wall hash okay and change your hash pattern let this one and match this to this let this very carefully we are providing minute detail which is very important to understand sectioning perfectly okay match this to this and extend up to here ads for auto door section okay style one because this is our kitchen door right so we have to place our door section pocket ceiling height 
80 right plus leaf thickness like our frame 5 inches total will go 85 this is our inch unit okay click first line and second line this is what this is your door section okay so we are getting 80 plus 5 if you take measurement you will get 5 inches more from window level okay this is okay let this line extend up to slab level this is our wall okay and this is our ceiling level right match this to this simply this is our wall above the door okay let this very carefully as i said this detail we are getting identical from previous chapter if you didn't watch you must watch out this chapter we have designed our four side elevation click here this is our identical section detail we have taken from elevation now take projection area for your sectioning okay take this point this point and provide here solid hedge okay let this solid hedge and match this to this and simply trim this area what you do same select all and just mirror another side because this side also will cover our this part this is okay this is our parapet including projection okay as i said this is our ceiling level let this one inch more take this straight line this will define our about detail back side okay let this dimensioning 8 feet 6 inches let this dimension layer parapet clean we are getting projection including parapet 5 feet okay let this window area this 35 inches and this part let this 45 inches and then our clean slab okay let this scale little bit okay sd 1 is to 4 okay 1 is to 3 keep 1 is to 3 select these dimension it will reduce automatically this is okay this line we are getting back side okay so we will keep hidden line just select this two line and take this hidden line okay type xt to scale your line type this is okay and keep any light color this is exactly our back side okay let this door section dimension including frame we are getting seven feet one inches and then we are getting clean slab two feet eleven inches around three feet okay drawing frame for the reference just copy and keep it here this is our drawing frame well you can arrange well this is just for the reference okay so this is our drawing frame and keep in this area now what you do take this text this text exactly our section aa okay let this match your elevation height okay from this point and move above okay let this base point it must be exactly same as per elevation height if you see here we are getting nine inches here so what we do this is our board thickness let this here two inches three inches more okay take excel line to match our detailing now you see here we are getting correct frame as per our elevation height well we will match plan projection also let this excel line okay copy this line if you are a regular user you know sectioning this is very important to match as per plan as per elevation your section is very important er double a to on every layer and place door here because we have removed previously right if you see here in plan dining room living room we are getting one arcade area right so this arcade we had to place in sectioning because our section line crossing through this arcade copy this arcade take this reference point and keep it here you are getting here select this arcade and rotate from that base point and keep above this area this is our like arch okay arch entrance from 
living to dining so let this arcade just small curve like this okay so let this see a curve this is our curve means we are getting arc at this point so this will be our curve area for entrance through living area to dining area okay so we are getting like this now kitchen dining and living this is our text you must to place your text also this part locating our living area okay dining area okay and then our kitchen area okay and keep it here now what i do i will take this full move inside okay and keep it here so we have created our perfect detailed section see if you understand this identical detail you can create any type of complex sectioning also it depends on you how much you practice and how much you utilize this tool to fastest your sectioning okay this is exactly not one day learning you had to give repeated practice if you are new to this technique okay if you have any query any doubt must leave your comment okay you did not join membership i encourage you to join membership you will get amazing insights over there let's pretend free use blocks advanced tutorial ai tools tips and tricks you will get inside membership okay and also this is the best possible way to support those who influence your knowledge and learning if you want to learn why you are comprehensively you can find the course link in description i hope you got this tutorial helpful if you have any or any doubt must leave your comment as soon as possible i will reply your query thanks for watching i will see you in the next video